Aloha, Simona here. Good morning. Aloha, Kakayaka, Kako. <laughs> and Hawaiian, Simona. From here, Transform and Flourish. I have a, I woke up with a thought this morning. I've been awake for a couple of hours, but this is my face this morning. <clears throat> I'm taking it very easy. I'm about to hop on my, my yoga mat. But for now, I'm still like drinking my superfood coffee and just like taking it easy. I was still in bed. I just opened my eyes and um, and this uh, thought came through. So we tend to just say, I mean, especially me and my group of spiritual healers, friends and stuff here in Hawaii, we tend to say like, oh, I, I believe they're being tested by universe or spirits or creator, however you, ident whatever you identify with. We tend to say, uh, oh, I, I don't know. I've been asked, I've been asking for more abundance, and I'm being tested. Yes and no. What I feel, what I, the 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 thought that came through this morning, um, I don't want to say channeling, but yes, <laughs> it was just channeling this message for my own truth. I was like, we're not being tested, really. The fact is that we only become more aware of that situation, of that limiting beliefs or that um, that we are creating because our focus is completely on that. Um, for example, when you have pain or like an injury on on like when somebody got an injury like for example I've been dealing with bursitis in my elbows and you don't realize until you focus your attention on that freaking pain that your elbow is very important <laughs> and with the pain in your elbow it gets difficult to do many other things right so uh, yeah that's where like your focus just goes like boom and so that's what happens so it's like okay for instance like this is what I've been working on um, I've been working to acquire the virtue of tolerance and being more accepting um, doing so it means for me to release more and more of the critical mass and judgment right and in in this lifetime that we're living which is a little like surreal and interesting and there's more and more in that and it's like insane like it seems like people are tapping more like collective is tapping more into judgment and critical uh, critical mass and criticism and uh you know quick to judge and angry you know we have all these things right now so um, I've been trying to you know work on that acquire and download more of myself with um, yeah absence of judgment or more tolerance and and of course everything that I can notice right now around me is like the more I try not to be critical with myself or with others or about others this is what I keep noticing like even last night um, like a girlfriend we're chatting on the phone da, 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 and I'm expressing like like a desire of doing something you know like oh yeah I'm you know I shared my thought with this friend of mine I think I would like to do this and uh, I have in my plans to stay staying open of course because I don't know what universe and creators plans are for me but you know this is what I'm putting out there and uh, we'll see and uh, this friend of mine on the phone was like oh yeah that's cool but please don't raise to hurt that person uh, that you're working with because she's amazing she has been growing and she this and she died and she this and she died and I was like all beautiful things but it was still like for me like a sort of like even though it was positive like a sort of judgment right so and I do it all the time it's like totally genetic in my family even uh, in genetic keys I totally have it. It's one of my main keys, unfortunately. So, um, in in Italy, Europe is like OMG. It's like totally like critical judgment, 
blah 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 gossipy and it's like it can be really sharp some tongues can be really sharp you know really sharp long story short what i came up with with this morning it was like this, um why don't we say instead of being like already giving our suggestion when it's not really asked for instead of telling us telling other people like you know like the my phone call could have been like oh yeah yeah i kind of want to do this i'm dreaming about doing that i'm trying to plan and you know move in there and do this and uh, and and i it would have been so awesome to be that person i would have be like Oh, cool. I don't completely agree with your decisions because I am myself and I'm standing in my own truth. But I'm stuck for you. If this is what you want to do, I totally support you or I have support you. You know, I believe that I recognize that your worth, your effort, all the time that you put into your growth and all these. And uh, so, yes. Uh, you deserve it. I'm here for you. I support you and that would have been like totally no judgment for others and it would be like uh, narrowing the, um, the conversation to me and her only you know like the person on the phone and yes i believe that that would be much easier you know and it would be so much better no one else had been brought up in this conversation right so yeah i mean like seriously i hear it every day and like i said guys i am no saint i didn't get it all figured out yet i do teach um how to work with energy how to grow and and you know unleash your magic reclaim your divinity yes but i'm still in a human body yes i might have been like an ascendant monster before or an angel or whatever but yes i'm here i'm remembering and reclaiming my own divinity myself first so you know this is another important thing remember we are in a human experience so it's okay to feel judgmental to fall back into things you know it's like I'm not a Buddha yet. I'm not Jesus Christ yet. I'm not, you know what I mean? Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, forgive yourself because all this judgment uh, and this uh, criticalness takes us to become resentful of other people. Uh, it, mm, it makes us comparing ourselves, become envious, became, become jealous. And these are all feelings of such a lower vibration. And it would be like, we're trying to, the collective mind is awakening, there are more people vibrating higher. Let's keep our vibrations high. Let's be aware, let's become aware, let's become more focused on like, what comes out of our minds, hearts, mouth, you know? Let's be a little more aware and I and I love it and this is amazing time to release full moon is tonight I think and it's in Aries which is pirate you know so I woke up really passionate about this and I'm sharing and by the way I love you all stay tuned lots of news new beginnings amazing things happening and they can happen for you too if you want to this weekend i'm taking another to the healing update <laughs> upgrade <laughs> in every sense energetically and physical i guess and um on manifestation and abundance so stay tuned i might start sending you some downloads if you give me permission i love you all have a wonderful day